Hey, it's Scott Owen at Cruise Consulting, and today we're talking about a startup question. Is it better for startups to pay a vendor via check or credit card? Now, for the startup, it's always easier to pay via credit card. It's super convenient, you give them the number, they run the transaction, and if you use Brex, like what we like and we put companies on, then it integrates into QuickBooks super easy, and it's very easy for us, your accountant, to characterize a transaction. It actually does it automatically most of the time because of our proprietary software. So we love it when startups pay via credit card. Now, there's a lot of times where vendors, the person you're working with, doesn't want to accept credit card. And the reason why is credit cards have a pretty hefty fee. Usually it's about 3%, 2.5%, 3%. And they don't want to pay that. I don't blame them because that's a lot of money. That's a lot of margin to lose. So they want to be paid via check. Now, for us, the accountant, the worst solution is for you to actually write a check to that vendor. The reason why is we use Plaid to pull down tons of data from bank accounts and integrate into our proprietary systems, and we do not get check images from Plaid. It doesn't have them. So we have to manually go into your bank account, click the check image once the, the check is cashed, and look and see who you wrote in your chicken scratch to on that check. So that is not a great solution for us, your accountant. But luckily, there's something called bill.com, which is out there. And bill.com does all of this electronically. And it's super easy to pay vendors via a check, or it's more like an ACH, like a direct payment, because bill.com has a payment system network where it connects to your vendors, gets their bank account on the other side, and actually just does like a direct deposit into their bank account. And guess what? We don't have to log into your bank account and read your little chicken scratch on that image. Even better, Bill.com allows you to upload the invoice into Bill.com, which syncs into QuickBooks and matches the payment when that actually goes out. So the real question you should be asking as a startup is, should I pay vendors via credit card or Bill.com? Because Bill.com is a superior solution to just writing a check. And in that situation, we're pretty agnostic but I do think credit cards are a little bit easier for people. So I would always lean towards the credit cards, but of course, if your vendor is not accepting the credit card because of that fee, most likely, then go ahead and just use bill.com. We put all of our clients on bill.com. It's super easy to use, and you'll have a invoice record. You'll have be able to pay your vendor electronically, and your accounts will be very happy with you. Hope that helps. Thanks.